craziest recently discovered animals. So far, science has discovered around 2 million species of plants, animals, and microbes, and they're not done yet. It's estimated that there are still millions left to discover, and every year we're finding new and interesting species to add to the list. We're going to delve into some phenomenal discoveries from the past few years. But before we get into today's video, make sure that you're subscribed and ring the bell so that you never miss any of our upcoming videos. Philopteryx dewey Thankfully, we can just call it the ruby sea dragon because its scientific name is a mouthful. The deep sea red dragon was first described in 2015, and it's found along the coast of Western Australia. Although not that recent, what makes this a unique find is that it's the first sea dragon to be discovered in the last 150 years. Nymphister cronauri. This highly intelligent beetle is found in Costa Rica, and when you see the beetle in its natural habitat, chances are you'll look right past it. These beetles live exclusively with nomadic ants from the region, and they hitch a ride on the ant's abdomen. The abdomen of the ant and the shape and size of the beetle are the same, so the beetle hitches a free ride and has protection from predators at the same time. Phytale visarian and Phytale dragon. There are over 12,000 species of ants, which is why discovering new ones quite often doesn't really surprise people. These two new species are referred to as the Game of Thrones ants. They were discovered in New Guinea and have unusually large heads. On their backside, you'll notice some impressive spikes, hence the name, Game of Thrones ants. The spines are thought to act as a defense mechanism, but closer inspection suggests that it's merely a byproduct of the muscular support system in place to accommodate their overly large heads. Tapanuli orangutan. Although not a new discovery, the Tapanuli orangutan has finally been made an official species all on its own. They were classified in the same species as Sumatran and Borneo orangutans, but these orangutans, native to Indonesia, have their own long, high-pitched calls. They are the rarest great ape in the world, and there are only a few remaining. Pseudoliparis swire. As we're heading deeper and deeper into the Mariana Trench, so are more species of animals cropping up. This is the Mariana snailfish, and they're small, reaching only about 4 inches. It's believed they are the top predator in their community, but very little is known about them. Simba Kubwa Kuto Kafrika. Be grateful you didn't live in Kenya 22 million years ago because this beast is one you would have had to deal with. Described as being scarier than any of the beasts that J.R.R. Tolkien created, this creature was larger than a polar bear and weighed in the region of 3,300 pounds. They were 8 feet in length from snout to tail. Classified as a hyper carnivore, the name of the beast is Swahili for Big Lion from Africa. A fossil of this animal was recently found in Kenya in a museum gathering dust under the label of a hyena. Gramastacus lacus. Coastal New South Wales in Australia recently brought forward this small freshwater crawfish. It's one of the smallest crawfishes in the world, weighing just 7 grams. To survive dry seasons, they burrow themselves into dry banks. They hide among the reeds to protect themselves against predators like speckled long fin eels, giant water bugs, and eastern long necked turtles. Strix hadarami. This desert tawny owl was recently discovered in North Africa and the Arabian Peninsula. They make their homes in the desert, semi-desert, palm groves, and rocky areas. They are nocturnal and feed on mice and large insects. They were recently given the species name of Strix hadarami, differentiating them from other tawny owls. Ilakmi tobini. Not too recent, but worth a mention anyway. This creature has made many lists not only because of the large number of legs it has, but also for the four appendages it boasts. Millipedes make you think of an animal that has thousands of legs, but most of them only have 62 legs. The Ilacme plenipes holds the record for the most legs at 750, but the Ilacme tobini boasts 414 legs. They have over 200 poison glands and are completely blind. Discovered in California's Sequoia National Park, the four appendages we mentioned also double as legs to help it maneuver underground. Tardigrade. First discovered in 1773, tardigrades are also known as little water bears, and they are a type of phylum that live in water. They are a micro animal, and they look a lot like a bear. Recently, a new tardigrade was discovered living in a bit of moss growing in a Japanese parking lot. Kazuharu Arakawa, a Japanese researcher, had been taking moss from anywhere he found it and would place it under his microscope. Imagine how excited he must have been to discover that tardigrades live in moss too, and this particular species is vegetarian. Japanese pig 
pygmy seahorse. Also referred to as the Japan pig seahorse, this recently discovered seahorse is the size of a jelly bean. Hard to pinpoint its exact color as they blend in perfectly with the algae-covered reefs in southeastern Japan where they're found. They feed off of plankton, and they have wing-like protrusions coming from their neck. Japan pigs only have one protrusion as opposed to the usual two seen in other pygmy seahorses. The function of them is still unknown. Sebrenus reckenbergi. Hopefully this spider is running away from you and not towards you because you'll be flick-flacking to get away from it. Also called the Moroccan flick-flack spider, this newly discovered arachnid has a bizarre defensive technique. If it feels threatened, it will do cartwheels to get out of danger quickly. Bathysaurus ferox. It must be hard to find a suitable partner at the very depths of the ocean, so this deep-sea lizardfish took things into its own hands. Or its own fins? This creature has developed both male and female reproductive organs to boost the species' numbers. The first time this species was caught was in 2017 off the east coast of Australia. It is one of the top predators of its habitat and will eat practically anything that crosses its path. The mouth is crammed with sharp teeth, so despite its small size of only 20 inches, prey doesn't stand a chance. Tosinoides aphrodite Found in the waters of a remote Brazilian archipelago, a team of divers came upon this most dazzling fish. Apparently, they were so enamored with the fish's beauty they didn't notice a shark hovering directly above them. They named the fish after the Greek goddess of beauty, Aphrodite. The males and females differ in color. Perichylinus paniorum. Not too much is known about this fish that was discovered in central Indonesia in 2016, except that they are exceptionally beautiful. And they're a species of the flasher wrasse. The Central African Slender-Snouted Crocodile It's a mouthful, we know, but this crocodile has finally been given its own name and distinction. Found throughout Africa, they were put into the same category as Mysostops cataphractus until subtle differences in complexion were picked up by Florida International University. They also realized that the scales were smoother and softer, and the skull a slightly different shape. It's believed there are less than 500 of these crocodiles left in the wild. Spider from the Salinopidae family. It doesn't have a name yet, but a spider from the Salinopidae family has recently been discovered, and it's said to have the fastest leg-driven turn of any animal on the planet, which is pretty impressive considering it has eight legs. Three new species joined this group not too long ago, which was only recognized recently despite being originally collected in the 1800s. Gecko Lepus Megalepis. Just the name is brilliant, and this newly discovered gecko doesn't disappoint. Found in northern Madagascar, the gecko has very large scales. If a predator has the gecko in its mouth, the scales shed easily, leaving the predator with a mouthful of scales and the gecko has a chance to escape. It's the first time geckos of this species have been discovered since the 1940s. Arapaima. We have known about this fish for a while, some of the world's largest and most endangered freshwater fish. In 2016, a whole new species of the Arapaima was discovered in southwestern Guyana. These giant fish can grow up to 10 feet long and weigh 440 pounds. They have a primitive lung, allowing them to breathe air. Somersetite. New minerals and meteorites are also being discovered yearly, not just animals. There are 5,500 known minerals with roughly 100 added to the list each year. In 2018, 11 new minerals and one new meteorite were introduced. One of them was somersetite, found in the Mendip Hills of southwest England. Edmoteris benchleyi. You'll much prefer the other name for this unattractive shark, the Ninja Lantern Shark. It's got the craziest ability to glow in the dark. Its skin is pitch black and it has bulbous eyes and is thankfully pretty small. It was discovered in 2015 and research on this unique species is ongoing. They're found in the Eastern Pacific Ocean and were named after Peter Benchley, shark lover and author of Jaws. They eat small fish and shrimp and grow to around half a meter. Himalayan Thrush. First described in 2016, this little thrush has been put in a separate species from the alpine thrush. They have shorter legs, tail, and wings, but their bills are longer than the alpines. The Himalayan thrush breeds in forested habitats, whereas the alpine thrush breeds above the tree line. Dendrogramma enigmatica First described in 2014, the Dendrogramma enigmatica was discovered on the ocean floor in Victoria, Australia. It's a multicellular animal that's believed to be related to the jellyfish, coral, or sea anemones. In 2016, it was further identified as a siphonophore, and studies have been unable to reveal any sex organs or a nervous system. 
Limnonectes larvae partis. It sounds like something that could cast a spell, but it's really just a species of fanged frogs that were discovered in northern and western Sulawesi, Indonesia. The first time the frog was mentioned was in 1994, but it's only received its formal name in 2014. The frog has internal fertilization, which means it gives birth to tadpoles and doesn't lay eggs externally like other frog species. The International Institute for Species Exploration named this frog as one of the top new species to be discovered in 2014. Club-tailed scorpions In 2018, three new species of club-tailed scorpions were introduced. They had formed part of the group of neotropical club-tailed scorpions, but in-depth studies of this group made researchers realize that three needed their own specific species. So it's not so much of a brand new discovery, just a relabeling effort. These scorpions have the unique ability to rub a comb-like structure on their bodies against their abdomen, causing a hissing sound, which humans can hear. It's a warning to get as far away as possible. Deutrogenia ossarium. Discovered in 2014, this is also called the bone house wasp. It was found in China and named after graveyard bone houses. The female wasp takes dead ants and fills her nest up with them. The dead ants emit a chemical that keeps the predators away from her nest. These wasps are an aggressive species with a very painful sting. Which of these discoveries do you find the most intriguing? Let us know in the comments below. 1. Phryganistria tamdaoensis. This stick insect was discovered in Tam Dao National Park in northwestern Vietnam. It belongs to the family of giant sticks, despite only being 9 inches. Not much is known about this stick insect, and if you'd like to see one for yourself, head to the Royal Belgian Institute of Natural Sciences in Brussels.